Well, good morning. This is Plant Smart Living with Farmer Fred. Really glad you could join me today out here in the vegetable garden. It's a beautiful day here in Pennsylvania Zone 6. Well, anyhow, today I thought I would do a taste test comparison between the yellow pear variety tomato right here and alongside it I have my sun gold cherry tomatoes and so I thought I would do a taste test and see which one is really sweeter you know which one is my favorite so thanks for joining me today out here in the garden So I'm here, this is my cattle panel trellis. And I did a video on how you can install one of these in your garden for under $45. You know these, they're 50 inches wide by 16 feet long. I bought this at Tractor Supply. And then you, then you need to also buy four T-posts. But then anyhow, in the springtime after the danger of frost, I planted a sun gold cherry tomato that's here on my right. And then I also have a yellow pear variety that I planted here in the spring. And so these are some of the yellow pear variety that I was harvesting earlier. And so I thought I would grow these yellow pear variety. I actually started these by seed in my basement over the winter. But I thought I would just uh, grow one of these in the garden and see how they tasted, you know, because it's always fun doing experimenting. Uh, with different plants out in the garden and so you know the question is which one is my favorite you know uh, after growing one alongside the other and uh, one thing I've noticed is that my sun gold cherry tomatoes they really reached maturity much quicker you know at least for me here in Pennsylvania I've been uh, eating these tasty and delicious sun gold cherry tomatoes off the vine for at least a month and so yeah the last couple weeks they just started to really turn yellow so I could actually start to eat these but anyhow I have to I have to say that you know you just I'm gonna pick the most yellowest tomato here and you know do a taste test comparison Maybe even just take another one, you know. They really do look like a, a pear. I mean, they taste pretty good, you know. They have a, a nice taste, nice texture to them. But, you know, some of these, these are the sun gold cherry tomatoes right here. Let's take another one up here. But I have to tell you, these sun gold cherry tomatoes, to me personally, are out of the park as far as sweetness. You know, they're definitely sweeter than the, the yellow pear variety here growing up my cattle panel trellis. In fact, let's just take a closer look at these tomatoes growing up this beautiful trellis. Bailey, what are you doing digging out here in the garden? You're not supposed to be digging out here. So anyhow, this, uh, this is the trellis that I built in the springtime and, and grew my uh, sun gold cherry tomatoes up. Then I used jute twine and tie it to the trellis as they grow up the this cattle panel trellis and I also I don't prune these I may prune the first few feet to get them growing up the trellis and then over here is where my 
the yellow pear variety is growing. But you can see how well they're doing. And you want to make sure again they get six to eight hours of sun, your tomatoes. I also grew with my Asian yard long beans up this trellis. You can see some of them hanging right there. So anyhow, I always encourage people to, we're gardeners, you know, try experimenting in your garden, you know. You could grow a yellow pear variety or even a sun gold and see what your favorite is. But honestly, if it's me, I would, you know, personally, I'm, I'm just going to be growing these sun gold cherry tomatoes from now on in my garden because, uh, like I said, they're just, they taste sweeter and they mature and ripen quicker too in the season. And they're, these tomato plants are very prolific, you know, and so these will continue to grow right up until the frost. And I'll probably even freeze, put some of these in a freezer bag and freeze them so I'll have them over the winter. So anyhow, I just want to thank you for joining me today out here in the vegetable garden doing a taste test comparison between the yellow pear tomato and the sun gold cherry tomato. So anyhow, I hope you have a wonderful day. And also, if you have any questions or comments, you know, feel free to leave them in the section below. And also, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so so you can receive future videos. And you'd also, you can also visit us at plantsmartliving.com. So anyhow, thanks for joining me today. Until next time, this is Plant Smart Living with Farmer Fred.